Schwartz. I think I've changed a lot as an artist and a person since high school um, just because that's what naturally happens um, you grow and my voice even sounded very different when I listened to my old records it's this little tiny voice and now I think it's matured and, uh, yeah. I didn't really have a day where I was like hmm I can sing it was just sort of uh, my family is very musical, so there was always music in our house, and there were always instruments in our house, um, which I'm very fortunate to have that. And I didn't even really think about it, I just would sing. Um, even now, I kind of sing like all the time, like with my friends. I'll, instead of saying something, I'll be like, hey, how you doing? <laughs> um, yeah, and I noticed that like if there's a song on the radio, I'll just be singing it and someone will be like do you know that song like, no I just <laughs> I can't stop singing somebody help me I can't stop singing <laughs> piano is mostly what I feel most comfortable on but I like to sort of like dabble and try out different things so I play guitar um, I can play a little bit of harmonica sort of um, I wrote some songs uh, I wrote a song on a banjo for this next record um, Sometimes I try and pick up, uh, what you might call it, uh, accordion. Yes, <laughs> um, I used to play the clarinet when I was in elementary school. I really just like to play a lot of things badly, and then I can play the piano. <laughs> that uh, TV licensing happened. It was sort of like a chance thing. My dad happened to be jogging through town, and he ran into this guy, Chris Doritas, who is a KCRW DJ and a music supervisor and my dad sort of knew him and said hi and he was like oh you know my daughter plays music can I give you a CD and I think Chris was a little scared he was like oh a daughter okay you can send me the music but then he listened to it and he actually liked it a lot and he said um, can I play this on the radio and I was like yeah that'd be great <laughs> and then he was working on this film called The Women and he was looking for someone to write the end credit song and so he just asked me, there were a lot of other people writing for it but he's like, just uh, give it a try and at the time I was uh, in high school, I was like 18 years old and I'd never done something like that before but it was really exciting to me and I wrote a song and they sent it to the director and she picked that song and then they needed uh, an opening credit song and they asked me again and I wrote that song, um, and so that was my first time writing for film, was for the film The Women. It's very different writing for film and TV because there's like a specific assignment. It's like when you're writing for yourself, you can go anywhere you want in the world, <laughs> in the musical world. When you're writing for film and TV, it's like you need to capture this specific feeling in this moment. And I like it because it's a challenge and it sort of gets me to write a song I would have never written otherwise. Um, yeah, and it's almost like you're a part of the film, the acting of the film, and just presenting you know, the sort of tone of what's going on. Yeah.